It's Megan with the blog WilsonHomestead.com and today I'm doing another vlog. It is Saturday. This weekend Luke only had one day off because last week he got one day off because it was too cold to paint. So just one, one day to work on stuff around here with Luke. So we're just finishing up the deck pen or actually Luke is finishing up the duck pen. I'm not I'm very helpful with stuff like that. <laughs> so my brother was here this morning and they got the rest of the siding on. And I think right now Luke is working on putting the door in and then we'll put the roof on. And then tonight, hopefully the ducks can move in. And I'm actually planning on putting the silkies in with them just because it's getting a little too cold. And silkies aren't very cold hardy to have them still in our mobile chicken coop. So I think I'll put them in there until the winter chicken coop is done, and then all the chickens will just go back together. Sophia, are you playing with Jimmy? Yeah. Can you show me? You playing with Jimmy over here? Hey, Jimmy. Jimmy. What you doing? You got something there? Oh, you got a nice big nail. Awesome. I wanted to show you guys these overalls I just got. I'm in this kind of weird postpartum time where my belly's not big anymore, so I don't fit into my maternity pants. They're too loose. Apparently my belly actually hold, holds those up a lot. And I don't fit in my pre-pregnancy clothes yet. So in the going into winter, I had no like warm, like long pants. So I found these overalls and I found a couple pairs of mom jeans and they're, they fit just perfectly and they're so comfortable and going to be nice and warm for going into these cold months until I can fit into my old clothes. So I'm really glad, really glad that I found those and I am a huge fan of overalls now. These are so comfortable. I'll give you a better idea of the color because it was kind of dark over there but they're it's really nice and comfy, and I got a sleeping baby still.
done. We, the guys got all the siding up and then Caleb left after that and Luke put the door in. We didn't put it where we originally wanted to. We were gonna put it in one of the short sides, but it was, the roof was too low, so we had to put it in the tall, long side, which is totally fine. So they've got a nice door, and I, it's really nice that it has glass on it, so it's still gonna be windproof, but they'll get some more light, and we'll be able to see them through it, so we don't have to install windows in it, or in the coop. And then Luke put some perches in there temporarily. We'll put nest boxes, but that's not terribly urgent because those ducks aren't laying this time of year anyway. But I am thrilled with how that coop is looking. It looks like a log cabin. It's just like the coolest thing ever. I really want to leave that wood just rough and not paint it. It won't stay good as long, unfortunately. I mean, it still would a long time. But I'm debating on whether or not it's worth it to kind of ruin a little bit of that cool old log cabin look. So we'll see. But I'm really happy that it's done and the ducks have their new house. day now and we put the silkies in last night so they could all wake up together in the morning that seems to be the best way to introduce poultry to each other and they did fine when they came out but then all the smaller silkies just went right back through the fences and are back at the old coop so I guess that's not gonna work to protect them from the cold so we're gonna have to wait until they're a little bigger and can't get out but by that time their coop will probably be done so I'm just gonna try not to worry about it the two big rooster silkies stayed there, so I guess I'll leave them there. And just hopefully the chicken coop gets done soon. This next weekend though, we have to work on drilling holes for new trees. I have an exciting video coming up about that. I'm not gonna give too much away, but we just got our auger bit in. We need to go to town drilling holes. So keep your eyes out for that vlog because that's gonna be pretty exciting. But I think I'm gonna end the video here. We didn't do quite as many things as last weekend because it was only one day. We just had Saturday to work on stuff. But I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what we did that day. Thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.